Hi, I am Teacher Daisy. Now, let's learn Form 4 Chemistry Chapter 6 Acid, Base and Salt, Part 1. In this part, you will learn 6.1 The Role of Water in Showing Acidic and Alkaline Properties 6.1 The Role of Water in Showing Acidic and Alkaline Properties Acid, the Swedish chemist, Arrhenius states that an acid, an acid is a chemical substance that ionizes in water to produce hydrogen ions. The term hydrogen ion, H plus, aqueous, is used to replace the hydroxonium ion, H3O plus, aqueous, for simplification. Example, hydrogen chloride molecules react with water and ionize to produce hydrogen ions, H+. Hydrogen ions then attach water molecules via the formation of a dative bond to produce hydroxonium ions, H3O+. Example, nitric acid become hydrogen ion and nitrate ion. Basicity of an acid. Basicity of an acid is the number of ionizable hydrogen atoms per acid molecule. Monoprotic acid. Mono means one. This acid contains only one ionizable hydrogen atom producing only one hydrogen ion proton per molecule of acid. Example. Hydrochloric acid, HCl. Polyprotic acids can produce more than one hydrogen ion per molecule of acid. Diprotic acid can produce two hydrogen ions per molecule of acid. Example, sulfuric acid, H2SO4, triprotic acid, can produce three hydrogen ions per molecule of acid. Example, phosphoric acid, H3PO4. Nonmetal oxides, which are acidic oxides, react with water to produce acidic solutions, which contains hydrogen ions, and turn blue litmus paper red. Carbon dioxide, CO2 reacts with water, H2O, to form carbonic acid, H2CO3. Sulfur trioxide, SO3, reacts with water, H2O, to form sulfuric acid, H2SO4. Not all nonmetal oxides are acidic oxides. Only those that are able to react with water can produce acidic solutions. For example, carbon monoxide does not react with water, and it is a neutral oxide. Acids are classified into mineral acids and organic acids. Mineral acids are obtained from minerals, whereas organic acids are extracted animal and plant materials. Examples Base Arrhenius states that a base is a chemical substance that ionizes in water to produce hydroxide ions, OH negative. Bases are divided into two categories, ionic bases and covalent bases. Ionic bases consist of metal oxides and metal hydroxides. Example, when a soluble metal hydroxide, such as sodium hydroxide, dissolves in water, it ionizes to release sodium ion and hydroxide ions. Example, when a soluble metal oxide dissolves in water, it reacts with water to form the hydroxide ion. For example, calcium oxide CaO reacts with water, H2O, to form calcium hydroxide, CaOH2, which ionizes to produce calcium ion and hydroxide ions. A base is a chemical substance that reacts with an acid to form a salt and water only. Example, magnesium hydroxide, MgOH2, reacts with hydrochloric acid, 2-HCl, to form the magnesium chloride salt, MgCl2 and water, 2-H2O. Example, 
Ammonia, NH3 is a covalent base. When ammonia gas, NH3 dissolves in water, H2O, it reacts with water to produce ammonium ion, NH4+, and hydroxide ions, OH negative. Notice that the ammonia, NH3 molecule has accepted a proton, H plus from water, to form the ammonium ion, NH4 plus. Alkalize, an alkali is a base, that is soluble in water and ionizes, to produce hydroxide ions. Bases, metal oxides, and metal hydroxides. Examples of bases and alkalis. Uses of acids and bases, acid, sulfuric acid, used to make, electrolytes, detergents, paints, polymers, fertilizers, nitric acid, to make, dyes, explosives, plastics, fertilizers, benzoic acid, as a preservative, ethanoic acid, as a preservative, to make, vinegar, methanoic acid, to coagulate latex. Base, ammonia, used to make nitric acid, fertilizers, nylon, cleaning agents, to prevent, coagulation of latex, sodium hydroxide, to make soaps, detergents, bleaching agents, calcium hydroxide, to make cements, bleaching, powder, to neutralize acidity in soils, magnesium hydroxide, to make toothpastes, antacids, aluminium oxide, to make antacids. Acids and bases need water to show acidic and basic properties. An acid only shows its acidic properties when it is dissolved in water. Water helps the acid molecules to ionize to produce hydrogen ions, which causes acidity. Without water, an acid won't show the properties of acid. Example, hydrochloric acid, HCl exists as molecules, when dissolved in organic solvents, like alcohol. HCl dissociates into H plus and Cl negative, when dissolved in water. Example, glacial ethanoic acid, contains pure ethanoic acid. With the presence of water, the molecules of ethanoic acid disassociate and form hydrogen ions. With the presence of hydrogen ions, ethanoic acid shows acidity. Without water, the molecules of ethanoic acid do not disassociate to form hydrogen ions. Without hydrogen ions, ethanoic acid does not show acidity. Example, citric acid crystal does not ionize to produce hydrogen ions. So it does not show acidity. Dry blue litmus paper remains blue. Citric acid dissolved in water turns dry blue litmus paper red. A base only shows its basic properties when it is dissolved in water. Water helps the base molecules to ionize to produce hydroxide ions, which causes basicity. Without the presence of water, there are no free-moving hydroxide ions. Therefore, in the absence of alkalis, do not show alkalinity. Example, dry ammonia gas of the ammonia gas, give no effect to the litmus paper. The ammonia dissolve in water can turn red litmus paper to blue. In water, the ammonia molecules, NH3, react with water, H2O and ionize to produce ammonium ions, NH4+, and hydroxide ions, OH negative. The hydroxide ions, turn red litmus paper blue. Propanone is an organic solvent. Ammonia dissolved in propanone, does not ionize, to produce hydroxide ions. Litmus paper does not turn blue. If you like this video, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to our channel. Thank you.